from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good evening, I'm student meteorologist Jake Sorber bringing you your CNET forecast. Behind me we can see mostly cloudy skies dominating the area. This is our view over Beaver Stadium right now and we do see some blue sky poking through so that's pretty encouraging. Currently we're sitting at about 39 degrees for our temperature here in State College but look at these winds. West southwest winds at 29 miles per hour. Those are some incredible winds and it's actually making the temperature feel a lot colder than 39, about 11 degrees colder to be exact. The feels like temperature currently is 28 degrees. In fact, speaking about those winds, earlier this afternoon around noon, we actually saw a gust of 51 miles per hour right here on top of the Walker building. So that's some pretty impressive winds that we're seeing today. Looking at our current satellite and radar, we can see that over the western part of the state, we're seeing those uh, snow showers really light up the area. Over here, in the State College region though, we are still seeing some rain showers in the vicinity due to that uh, warmer temperature at the surface not really supporting the potential for snow just yet. But as the temperature begins to fall throughout the evening, we will see those snow showers begin to move into our area. And speaking of that, looking at the RPM model run, this is showing us these streamers coming off of Lake Erie. And these are those lake effect snow showers that will be affecting us early this evening going into tomorrow morning. And in fact, those snow showers are going to dissipate as we go throughout the night. And then tomorrow we're gonna to see those clouds break a little bit and we will see the sun at times tomorrow. And then look at this, going forward in time all the way into Friday morning at 4.30, we will see a chance for some snow to move through. And this looks like a brief just passage of snow showers, but what this system is actually gonna do is it's gonna back build. And we are going to see the potential for that snow in State College around mid-morning on Friday. But that snow will transition into rain as the temperatures warm up throughout the day. As we can see, this potential for rain working through the area at about Friday at 3 p.m. So looking at our temperatures currently and going through tonight and into tomorrow, this here at 9.30, this is expected to be our temperature here in State College, 32 degrees. But as we go throughout the night, the temperature is going to drop down into the mid-20s for a low. And then tomorrow morning, we're going to step back up close to 40. We're expecting a high around 40 for tomorrow. But look at the feels like temperatures. So this is going through tonight into tomorrow morning. This is 630 AM tomorrow. Look at the feels like temperature here in State College. It's expected to feel like 17 degrees. That's crazy. And look it up here in Bradford, four degrees for a feels like temperature. It's April. That's a, that's that's crazy to think that you're going to be feeling like four degrees in Bradford tomorrow morning. For our forecast here in State College tonight, we're expecting a low of 26, like I previously said. A snow shower is gonna affect us later on this evening. Lingering throughout the, throughout the Commonwealth, these snow showers will be pretty frequent and winds out of the west at 15 to 20 miles per hour. Then for tomorrow, we're going to expect a high of about 41 degrees. Those skies are going to be clearing, so the sun will pop out, thank goodness. And the winds are going to die down a little bit coming from the west at 15 miles per hour. So now let's transition and look at our seven day forecast. So we are going to see that chance of snow Friday morning, and then it's going to transition into that chance for rain Friday afternoon. And then another chance for snow comes along on Saturday. But if we jump forward throughout the weekend, looking at Tuesday, yet another chance for some wintry precipitation. So winter isn't going away anytime soon, but eventually spring does have to come along the warmer temperatures are going to win out. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm student meteorologist Jake Sorber. Have a great evening.